going on youtube nation this is dark dividend if you guys are new to my youtube channel make sure you subscribe and hit notification bell so don't miss future videos so the power was um out temporarily and i really couldn't post a video but i have a upgraded and updated monthly passive income strategy that i implemented actually friday and again my goal is to earn one thousand to three thousand dollars a month on my monthly dividends or passive income and Eventually, I'll start looking at options as a strategy, but I'm not there yet. Let me worry about graduate school and everything. And this new covered call ETF I bought on Friday. I'll review these guys. I'll explain to you why I bought them. So if you're new to this YouTube channel, make sure you subscribe and hit the notification bell so you don't miss future videos. Smash that like button. Let's check this ETF out right now. And that one is... You know, I posted a video on TSLY that I bought, and now I bought APLY, which was on Friday. It's a Yield Max Apple Option Income Strategy ETF. So it was right around $20. So it was literally new. It's not even showing up on Google.com. I can't really show you that much uh, price wise or the trends, but this is very attractive for me so i'm gonna go over these guys and this is a huge game changer because i have this one i'm gonna load up, load up on this one and i'm starting to load up on this one and eventually i'll look at this one so again i have a goal to make a thousand three thousand dollars a month monthly dividends you know the income of these four potentially could buy me other dividend stocks so that's the goal to earn passive income with these guys and use the option income strategy etfs passive income because ever, a lot of people do options with apple and that's one thing that's huge so i'm going to go over these guys so the yield max aply option income strategy etf is an actively managed fund that seeks to generate monthly income by selling slash writing call options on apple apply pursues a strategy that aims to harvest compelling yields while retaining cap participation and the price gains of apple that's the nice thing I don't have enough money to get like 100 shares and start messing around with options. So look, they, they're barely even showing anything, but it was right around $20. I got it on E-Trade. So here's some information regarding these guys. The current yield is an annual yield an investor would receive. The most recently declared distribution, which includes option income, remained in the same going forward. The current yield is calculated by multiplying ETF's distribution per share by 12 and dividing the resulting amount of ETF's most recent nest asset value. Current yield represents a single distribution from the ETF and does not represent its total return. The 30-day SEC yield re represents net investment income, which excludes option income earned by such ETF over the 30-day period ending in 3-31-2023 expressed as an annual percentage rate based on ETF share price at the end of the 30-day period. All yield max ETFs have a, a gross expense ratio of, again, 0.99%. So I want to explain to you that that's a high expense ratio, but in the long run, if you're just focused on passive income, like what I'm doing, and to buy other dividend stocks, you know, this is something that really, I'm going to say this again, as a game changer, because I can do this option strategy with these guys, and they're doing it for me. Sure, they have an expense ratio, but if I reinvest the dividends, get about $200 to $300 a month with these guys, I can start buying other dividend stocks. I can start buying the other um, covered call ETFs with these guys. And again, what I said with QYLD, RYLD, XYLD, and Jeppy and Devo and Nusi, those guys are important. And, you know, they're QYLD, RYLD, XYLD, and DJIA 
are eventually going to be added to my M1 finance dividend portfolio. The reason why I'm doing that is so I don't have to start putting in money anymore. When I start earning really good quarterly dividend income and monthly dividend income, I want to start buying dividend stocks, not even touching it, and allowing my dividends to reinvest and having these guys like APLY buy dividend stocks. So I want to turbocharge my dividend portfolio. This is a game changer. So right here, again, their ticker is APLY. The premium discount percentage is 0.35%. Net asset value right now is $20.03. Closing price is $20.10. So it, there, it's everything's preliminary, but the options strategy with Apple and then you're having eventually um, NVIDIA. I mean, this is nice because I don't have the money for that. And these guys are doing it for me. Sure, the expense ratio is 0.99%, but who really cares? Because as I go over the Tesla one, their current yield is 74.24% and OARK, which I reviewed, was 40.08%. So again, I can use these guys combined to buy this, and I can use this to buy this, and this to buy this. There's a lot of strategies that I can implement with these guys, and this is what really um, has me excited. Because going over the dividend history of OARK and TSLY, of course, this, this is not financial advice for entertainment purposes, only disclaimer in the description, but going, uh, let me just show you the dividend history of TSLY and OARK. Now, again, TSLY is new, so we don't know how much it's going to be. That would be great to where it's almost, you know, a dollar um, per distribution, but it's not always guaranteed. So as you see right here, this was 82 cents. So, but if I can get to a consistent $250, $300, and then flip that, and then start using it to buy the other stuff. It could be like a chain reaction to buy the other ones. So that's one thing that I'm considering implementing. And I'll go over OARK. And here's OARK's dividend distribution. Okay, it's 74 cents, and then 109, and then 51 cents. There's a little bit more instability, I'm going to say, with OARK. But I'm still going to buy these guys. I haven't bought them yet. I want to see this experiment with these guys because I'm going to show you a few other things with yield max. This is on sec.gov. They have Apple, which is obviously just out, Amazon, Berkshire B, Coin, Meta, Google, Netflix, Nvidia, SQ, Tesla, and then they'll probably start doing other ones, which I'm anticipating. And I was actually exchanging uh, tweet, tweets back and forth, and I sent them a DM, and I was maybe going to try to do an interview with these guys and have them on this channel and save it and just discuss the option income ETFs, their plans and their strategies. Obviously, they don't want to reveal everything, but this is what they're unleashing. The Berkshire, I mean, Amazon, Berkshire B, Meta, Google, G-O-O-G, -O Netflix. I mean, that's pretty exciting. So I wanted to go over that real quick. And if you are new to this channel, watch my previous video. I'll put it at the end of the video as to why I bought TSLY. Because there's opportunities, people like myself, and maybe you might be in my shoes, cannot afford this amount to do 100 shares and then do options play. Okay? I'm getting the opportunity to do this. And then what happens? Maybe I could buy Apple with the income. I mean, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I mean, if I can get to, you know, 3,000 with a total with all of these, that would be amazing. So that's one thing that just is crossing my mind. And I get to a consistent $300 you know, monthly with each of these. I mean, think about this. Three, six, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Right there, I mean, that's 300, that's 3,000, okay? I can use that for a lot of things. 
So that's just an idea that I have in my mind that I can do. And this, these provide opportunities to actually do this. And, you know, I can, I, I mean, I'm very excited to see this strategy. I mean, I can literally use this to throw it in M1 Finance. I can do it in E-Trade. I can do it on my, I'm starting a little options pre-play thing on Webull. And, you know, I can start buying stocks, playing options trading, and go from there. So this is really a game changer that I see for people. Again, I'm not giving financial advice, but an opportunity for people who don't have the money for these type of stocks to use passive income with this. And I don't know what Dave Ramsey's talking about because I can tell you I blasted him in my intro. And by the way, I have new merchandise if you see at the bottom of this video so feel free to do that of course i get a small commission but that helps fund the channel and uh i'm very excited to graduate in august i just finished my semester actually my throat's a little scratchy because i smoked a cigar last night and as you know i was on ryan's uh chat last night so i actually uh, was exchanging texts back and forth with him there's after hours i don't mind hopping on in his after hours um, thing he doesn't compensate me by the way but it's just an idea so let me know what you think of this strategy i have if you are new to this youtube channel make sure you subscribe and hit the notification bell so not miss future videos i'm going to try to squeeze one in later so make sure you hit that notification bell after you subscribe take care and have a great saturday and it's pretty bad in ohio weather wise it's pretty miserable but hey you got to enjoy it here and there all right have a good one